Okay, so this is going to be a video uh, on page four and five of the Essential Element book. Um, and we're going to be going over these in class. And so this is just something for hopefully you can play along with um, when you have some free time to work on the flute. So I'm first going to review my hand position with my left hand, which is going to be facing me. I'm going to take my thumb and I'm going to put it on the flat side. We're not going to do double thumb for this one. We're going to do flat thumb. Um, single thumb. And then remember that as we go through the flute, this first key right here, I'm going to skip. I'm going to place my index key. It's going to be my first finger on my left hand on that next key. Skip the next key so that technically the third key of the flute, skip that one. And then where you see that open hole, right, or the groove, that's where my finger two, middle left finger is going to be, third finger, ring finger, and then my pinky is going to rest on that G sharp key. And then with my right hand, all of them have the grooves, and that's going to be four, five, six. And then my pinky is on that flat E flat key. So make sure we have that. Um, thumb is somewhere underneath comfortable. That's totally fine. When you are playing, you're not going to be able to see my whole body, but please make sure that the flute is parallel right here. You don't want it down. You don't want it up. You don't want it too far back, and you don't want it for too far forward. It should be nice and comfortable. Make sure shoulders are down and relaxed. All right. So now that we've gone through those reminders, I'm going to play a little bit closer. So I'm sorry you won't see my full hand position, but we will review each fingering. We're going to look at number one, which is our F. Um, F is on the fifth line of the staff for this one. And remember that a lot of these fingerings are going to be um, the exact same. So F for space is also going to be the exact same. Uh, the only change will be the aperture. Um, so just remember that as we go through our fingering quiz, a lot of the same fingerings for a lot of the same notes. So for F, we have thumb, one, two, three, four, and right hand pinky in the E flat. This is what an F sounds like. And so that is what we're aiming for. So I'm looking at number one. I'm thinking about my whole notes. I'm going to take a good two count breath. I'm thinking of the word two as I articulate the very front of the note. And I'm going to push my air all the way through and hopefully give a clean release at the end. All right, here we go. I'm putting my Met at 75 beats per minute. Please join me for our first note F. All right, here we go. Down, up, down, up. And stop. Give that a couple tries. Make sure that you're comfortable with that note before moving on to the next one. Um, but we're going to do number two. I'm so sorry. I know. Hello. I have a dog here. Doesn't like the flute. Um, we're looking at count and play. Now, this time I'm going to be articulating and I'm thinking of the word two, 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 two. And you can even see as I'm saying that word two, two, two. I'm getting that slight uh, movement and that's going to be kind of my tongue pushing my lip a little bit. So here we go. Count and play, articulating. Ready? And down, up, down, up. And stop. So something you might be hearing and something I need to work on when playing flute is that when I'm articulating, I'm almost hitting the overtone. I'm almost hitting the next note up. So try to figure out where it is inside your mouth and where you have to hit on your teeth to keep that exact aperture shape the same. So that way we're not putting um, too much air to overpressure to hit that overtone. And that's something I'm also working on. Okay, we're looking at number three, a new note. This is going to be E flat. E flat is going to be the fourth space of the staff. Now, E flat is going to be fingered single thumb, two, three, four, five, six, and pinky. So the only thing we do not have is our first finger. This is what an E flat sounds like. All right, I'm going to play with the metronome. Here we go, E flat, and down, up, down, up. And stop. Rock 
rock and roll. So now we're going to do number four. I'm sorry, you did not see my face for that one. We're going to do number four. Now this one, we are changing the note names. So make sure, um, I would do a couple of times on your own to feel what that E flat to F change like, because we're putting that first finger down and then we're lifting four, five, six, um, and still keeping that pinky. So I need to do that too. So I know doing that a couple of times, that's where my brain is. That's going to be the switch. So we're starting with E flat and we're going to change to F. Here we go. Number four, starting on E flat. Ready and down, up, down, up. Rest, change. I'll repeat it. So make sure that, again, we're getting comfortable changing those fingers because it's going to get very different as we continue on. Now, looking at number five, heading down, we're going to be learning our D. D is on the fourth line of the staff. D is going to be um, very similar to what we just had. It's going to be thumb, two, three, four, five, six. So this time, our first finger is not closing and our pinky is not closing. So again, thumb, two, three, four, five, six. This is what a D sounds like. So we're going to do number five, D whole note. Ready, down, up, down, up. And stop. All right. Now we are going to look at a lot of more moving notes. I'm going to go through my same singering process here. We would normally go through our counting, um, but now I'm going to go through my fingering. To, I'm going to check right now that I have my D to my E flat change, which is just adding that pinky, and then to my F change, which is putting down my first um, left hand finger and then removing my five, six, and pinky from my right hand. So again, I'm going to go through my singering process. Um, join me as I finger through this. Starting on that D. D. Ready, here we go. And down, up, down, up, singering, go. D, 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 D. Rest, breathe. D, D, E flat, E flat, F. I'll repeat again. D, 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 rest, breathe. D, D, E flat, E flat, F, rest, rest, rest. Okay. So now I'm going to play through that process. I'm going to play a test note D just to make sure I have that in my ear. All right, here we go. Number six. And ready, down, up, down, up. So again, hopefully that's helpful. Oops. Hopefully that's helpful. We're going to move on to page five. We got two more notes to go through. So the next note, this one is a big change, is going to be our C. C is going to be on the third space of the staff. And C is going to be fingered only first finger and pinky. So in my left hand, my um, pointer finger. No th nothing else, no thumbs, and in my right hand, the pinky. Now, we learned that this is a trick, so if you're not comfortable with that, you can technically put all of the right hand down. And if you want to do that, that's totally fine, right? Um, but C, it's going to sound like this. And I'm going to play now with my right hand completely down. So you can see my right hand. It's not going to make a difference. be very slight um but 
C's kind of a, a weird note on the flute as far as tuning wise. Um, so that's something that usually we have to mess around with. Um, there is no thumb. That's going to be the biggest thing. So remember to completely take that away as we switch from that D <laughs> where we had um, all those fingers down, you're completely switching to the opposite now. And so that's something to be aware of and practicing that D to C transfer, right? Kind of similar to the clarinet on the break. Um, we introduce that pretty quickly, kind of those flips. So that's something we're going to work on here in just a second. But we're going to do number seven, C, and I am going to be doing exactly what's written right there, um, one and pinky. Okay, here we go. Here we go, number seven. Ready? And down, up, down, up. So now we're going to look at number eight. We're going to be switching some fingers here. So I'm going to go through that singering process again. Remember that C, which is just the one and the, and the pinky, right hand pinky, go all the way switch to a D, which is going to be thumb, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so that's going to be the biggest change. And, and hopefully this tempo will be okay. But if you need to go slower, please practice slower. All right, I'm going to go through the singering process of number eight. Starting at eight and down, up, down, up, breathe. C, 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 D, rest, breathe. Up, 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 E flat. And again, go. C, 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 D, rest, breathe. Up, 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 E flat and stop. All right, so let's try this number eight. I'm going to play a test note C. Test note C real quick to make sure I'm in the right key. All right, I like that sound better. Here we go, number eight. Let's try this together. Ready? And down, up, down, up. that one more time. Um, I wasn't happy with the switch that I made from the last measure, taking the repeat. Um, one, because I put my thumb down. That's not the correct note, right? Um, but I'm going to do that one more time. See if you can do it with me. I think that's just good practice. I'm, I'm struggling with the C to D switch still. So hopefully the second time will be a little bit easier. One more time. Number eight, same thing. Ready? And down, up, down, up. both keep working on that. All right. And this next note we finally have is our B flat. Now we learned two B flats. So again, this B flat in the book is going to be fingered as thumb, one, four, pinky. Okay. And it sounds like this. Now, if you were in class last time, we also learned an easier fingering for thumb, which is going to be double thumb. That's going to be this top part right here. So we have the flat thumb, double thumb, one, and pinky. It's going to sound like this. A pretty, the exact same, right? And so, um, as you probably would notice, if you were actually playing C, right? The no thumb, just putting the double thumb could make it easier rather than um, putting single thumb and fourth. Um, so again, it's just kind of going through some chromatic passages or certain passages where it makes it easier um, to kind of do those tricks. So I'm going to keep doing what the book's doing for right now, but just know for your uh, fingering exam that 
both of those will be on the quiz and both of those are what's known in the fingering position charts. Okay, let me play B flat one more time just to make sure I'm right. I got them. Um, one, four, and pinky. All right, here we go. Number nine, let's play some whole notes. Touchdown. Right on, here we go. And down, up, down, up. Okay, so we now have just one more tune we're going to look at, number 10. I'm going to go through the singering process, and then um, I'm going to play the excerpt. Now, again, remember, there's some big changes there. We go from B flat to C. If you, um, We're going to try to encourage you to do that 1-4 um, position for that. However, if you do feel like the double thumb is easier, go for it for right now. Um, and then we're going to go in the F, E flat, D. All right, here we go. This is going to be singering. Number 10, starting on the B flat. Ready? And down, up, down, up, breathe. B flat, B flat, B flat, B flat, C, rest, breathe. Up, up, E flat, E flat, D, rest, repeat, and go. B flat, B flat, B flat, B flat, C, rest, breathe. Up, up, E flat, E flat, D, rest, 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 and stop. All right, last one. Let's play a test note B flat just to make sure that's correct. And here we go. And down, up, down, up. stop. All right. So hopefully these were helpful um, and we'll get to working on this in class. And if you have any questions or like to say any videos, please let me know. Thanks.